Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm back with more Wireland 2 for the Game Boy Color. So, time to do the remaining half of the game, playing the secret worlds. So let's begin. This part of the beginning of the, the very first level. And I remember taking forever looking for the exit by destroying hidden blocks and things like that. But in this one, what you have to do is... Guess what? Nothing! Don't press any fucking button! Don't you dare f press any button! And there you go! You win. <laughs> That's what you have to do. No need to play this one again. So yeah, now we're gonna get access to the first extra world. I'm gonna say the cutscene. Actually, before that, we can select the level. That's a big difference now. I think this one counts as chapter 1 also. Or chapter 2. Like a, an alternative chapter 2. So yeah, if you decide to keep sleeping, you are taken out of your own castle. And you change owner. Okay, this counts as uh, chapter 2. Invade Warrior Castle, and I have to go to the castle. That's weird, I just entered the castle again. Anyway. I have to go through the woods again. So basically... In this world, I have to play my own castle again. Again, it's a, it's a sort of alternative. It's an alternative development of events, right? I don't want to get attacked by these guys. Trying to kill them all. I'm sure the secret is by the end of this area. I'm a killer. Shame on me. No, I don't think I will find hidden walls like that. I'm not sure if I should go there right away. I saw some blocks. And I think I need one of these enemies eventually to destroy blocks. Maybe not. Maybe yes. So what's the point? Let's find out. Uh oh, that's not a good idea. I saw two doors, or it's only one. What about... Oh, I was thinking of using the enemy up there. Oh, no. I'm killing everyone. This might be an important secret, that's why I am... trying this. I want to kill everyone. I don't want to. Alright, let me see this door first. Could be the bonus game and... No, it's not. Well, that was a close call. Actually, what I should do is throw the enemy over there. I should have done that from the beginning. And I got another extra door. This could be the bonus game. And it is, okay. It, it wasn't it wasn't totally a waste of time. On the contrary, it was necessary. Alright, this guy again. The white guy should appear more often. 
Was it this one? Yep, nice. I was uncertain even. Is that a capsule? Some sorts. So I can go to two different doors. One of them should take me to the exit, the other one... It's just an area for a lot of coins. Yeah, I have an idea, let me see. Yeah, that was made on purpose in order to get all these coins, and so now we're gonna try it again. And do the complete thing. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> yeah. That's all, all the coins I can get in this area. I know I miss a door. But I want to go up first. Because this must be another place with lots of coins. Whoa! Oh, always one at a time. I was trying to break the game by killing two of these guys at the same time. But it's not possible, apparently. No! Just money. Well, isn't that enough? Okay, it's taking me to two different areas. Let me go back to the other one then. I'll be skipping all these uh, angry guys. I don't feel like dealing with them. Ah, uh, this is for, for, probably for getting even more coins. Yeah. This was... I, I thought this was the last... The, the right area to leave the level. So that's why I, I left it for later, basically. But I need to go up, actually. That's fine. At least I'm done with the bonus game, which is probably the major secret, as you know. Okay, now I do have to deal with these assholes. Nah. Seriously, I tried to kill two guys at the same time. Uh, it's impossible with these ones. Anyway, um... If I'm not totally mistaken, I should be. This should be the last area, the last room in the on the level. Remember, I'm going to my own castle again because I got kicked out. Basically, due to the fact I decided to keep sleeping instead of doing what I did in the actual or the very first chapter, which is which was to wake up and kill the enemy. Oh, actually, I want this. Coins 40. Not bad at all. I've been wasting a little bit of time, but at least I've been getting lots of rewards, lots of money, and I win. More than 400, not a bad number at all. Here's a little change sub game contents will change slightly. I think I already told you this at some points. This is a tutorial. Each panel costs 50 coins. We know that. But now, it's gonna get reduced by its own. You don't have to choose when to flip the, uh, the panel. So basically, 
The only button you have to press is the stop button. When you think you know what number is, press B button. But before that, the panels will keep flipping on their own and of course making you spend the money. Which is actually easier. It's a one. Nice. Realized very fast. But yeah, this is a new method. In theory, could be harder, but in my opinion, it's actually easier and faster to complete. And now, every time you beat a level, you can select the, um, the respective chest. Storm the castles! Yeah, I think I'm now in the entrance of my own castle. In terms of level of difficulty, yeah, you can say that the secret worlds are slightly more complex, slightly harder, but not too much. It's it's a, like a good expansion, though. It's a very good expansion. In terms of challenge, mostly. I know in, in that door there is a switch. Oh, what's over here? Yeah, in the castle, finally. Yeah, I think there is only coins in here. Gotta check it out. I don't think it's a bad idea. Well, I'm basically exploring new areas or, or new rooms on my own castle. Again, it's a it's a very interesting expansion. These are like alternative ways. Optional endings, if you will. So basically, by pressing the switch, all of these blocks went downwards. I'm not sure which one is the one I need to get the actual exits. Probably this is the one. So let me go up because I saw um, a narrow made out of coins. When another door might be necessary, I don't know, to get the bonus game or some more money. I'll use these buddies. There you go. Well, that was unfair. You're both dead. Actually, I wasn't supposed to kill any of you. Or well, probably at least one of you should have been kept alive. You will die. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. Actually, I needed both of them alive. We already got a hand with coins, under extra coins. I need one of you up there. Yeah, 40 more coins. It would have been enough just to get a silver coin and get the fuck out. Anyway. Now we're gonna continue through the normal way. Whoa. I'm a little trapped. And also, I got the impression that these areas are slightly longer. I'm missing stuff. I remember killing an enemy. Don't tell me I needed that enemy. No, never mind. How to get up there, I was wondering. Looks a little easy. But before that, let me go even higher. Yeah, I'm sure I need one of these enemies. To get up here, get the extra money. Yeah, I think I got all of them. All of the big warrior coins. Oh, just in case, I want to warn you. I might get interrupted any time, and I will have to stop the recording more than likely. So, when that happens, I will let you know what that happens, and that that could occur in the middle of the level. So, I will let you at least get this finished. But if I cannot, for some reason, I could get interrupted 
I don't know, in the next 5 or 10 minutes. Those are the risks of recording at certain uh, hours, certain times. The thing is, um, I cannot record at any other time today, so that's why. It's early in the morning, then I have to go out and, and stuff. It's 9.35 here, AM. Early morning. Well, you know, I usually do my recordings in the morning. Sometimes I do it, like, after lunchtime. Because I need to go to class, then go back, have lunch, and then... ...do some more recordings. Actually, they ne never do... ...recordings. Hardly ever, at night. Let me see if I can burn those! There we go. I think I... I'm gonna be missing some area with plenty of coins below. 450, it's a very good number actually. Let me get these ones destroyed. Let's see if I can get them right away. It would be a pretty interesting thing. Yeah, I shouldn't touch the water. It's a little risky. Perfect. Perfectly timed. Perfectly goddamn timed. Now we can leave. Need to be pancake. Actually, should I avoid getting a pancake, becoming a pancake? So let me go back. Remember, with water, you get back to normal. Not necessarily with that other bat around. Stop using that thing. Annoying, distracting. But I'm sure now I have to become a pancake on purpose. Let me continue like this. Oh, actually, I shouldn't become a pancake to get to the next room. Alright, I don't see the bonus game anywhere. Oh, platforms are falling now. I'm a little worried. Oh, this fucking area. God damn. Yeah, speaking of becoming a pancake. Being mandatory. I mean, one of those little passages took me to the bonus game and the other one took me to the exits. So I need to be pancake on purpose. Oh my god, no, don't do that. Fucking earthquake effects. But look at the amount of coins I'm getting. That's pretty good, actually. That's one of the great benefits out of this place. Problem is, yeah, I need to be pan become a punky for pretty much accessing all of these areas. Let me see. From here... I get to the exit. Okay, that's simple enough. And on the other passages, there's another door with the bonus game. And if you go to the left, you can get... areas with plenty of coins. Which I might... Pass on for now. This could be the one. It's actually the one below. Let me see if I can make it from here. Remember, in on the edge, while being a punky, do not jump. There is no need to. If you jump, you won't be able to make it on the Precise spots. Yeah, this should be the bonus game. Perfect. Okay, that took less than expected. That's a lot easier than expected. Yeah, I used to have trouble because... Again, I used to jump on the edges. So that didn't allow me to get on the right spot. So I needed to try and retry many times. That area. It's a little tedious if you fail. I don't think I saw the guy, but I... Okay, got confused. Similar colors. It was down there. An eyeball. A blue eyeball. It's kind of creepy. No! So, yeah. Again, I, I could go... To, that, to those areas with coins, but I'm gonna pass on getting them for now. 
Yeah, me missing money on purpose. It's it's uh unacceptable. I know, I know. I should kill myself. It's only like this. Of course, if you have the time and the patience to do that, I do have the patience, but probably not the time right now to do all of that exploring. Wow, all, over three thousand. Of course, I'm gonna lose all this. Get back to the two thousands eventually. Uh oh, was that a good idea? I think it's a three. Yeah. Okay, perfect. They still have more than three thousand. Pretty good. That was risky, actually, I have to say. Okay, guys. Um, I need to stop this for now. Next time, hopefully, I'm gonna do the three remaining levels. Or at least two of them. In this first secret world. Back to Wires Castle, of course. An alternative uh, way just to, you know, experience these uh, events in the game. Well, thank you all for watching. I'll see you later.